Hi everyone, welcome to Tokyo Kitchen Japanese Cooking Class. This is Yoshimi. Today I'm going to show you how to make tuna mayo daikon salad. Today I'm using daikon radish, but you can use turnip instead. It's very easy and quick to make. Let's get started. These are what you need. Daikon radish, it's about 10 cm. Canned tuna, 1 tablespoon mayonnaise, 1 teaspoon soy sauce, some salt and pepper, and green onion. I'm cutting the daikon radish first, so let's peel it. Cut it in half. And make very thin slices. Sit down and into thin strips. Let's put it in the large bowl. Same for the other one. One teaspoon salt. Mix it well. And leave this for 10 minutes to bring up the moisture. Green onion. Cut the bottom off. Cut them in half. Put them together. Cut them in half. Put them together. And slice thinly. Put it in the small bowl and put it aside. I'm making tuna mayo, so let's strain the tuna. Small bowl and strainer. Let's put the tuna. Press it down. The tuna into the large bowl. One tablespoon mayonnaise, one teaspoon soy sauce, a little bit of salt and pepper, and mix it well. By now, daikon radish should be wilted, so let's squeeze it really well and put it into the bowl. So take some. Squeeze it really well. Into tuna mayo. If you don't squeeze it well, the salad will be very watery. So make sure to squeeze it really, really well. This much water came out from the daikon radish. It's a lot. Let's put the green onion. Mix it well. Serve it in the bowls. Try to create a little Mount Fuji for better presentation. And tuna mayo daikon salad is ready. Very easy. <clears throat> Time for the tasting. Itadakimasu. Mmm. It's very fresh but rich at the same time thanks for the tuna mayo. Delicious. This is how standard Japanese combo style meal looks. Right? soup, main, two side dishes. Tuna mayo daikon salad is a side dish, so let's put it here. For the other side dish, I usually have some sort of pickles, either homemade or off the shelf. 
For the rice and the main dish, let's have dry curry. I think creamy tuna mayo is a nice balance with spicy curry. For the soup, you could have miso soup, but I think I want to have onion soup. I'm sorry, no video for this one. I hope you enjoy the meal. That's all for today. Thank you so much for watching. More videos coming up on every Monday, Wednesday and Friday, so don't forget to subscribe and turn the notification bell on so that you don't miss anything. Bye!